Hi there, welcome to this tutorial all about how to create labels using Tapestry. Now once you've loaded up Tapestry, you need to go to the Children tab, and this will take you to the page of all your children. Now currently, I've selected a filter to show only one class, my Apple class. But obviously you can choose it to have all the children shown, or um, just a selection. Now I've only got six children in this group, but you can also select to have either 12, 24, 48, or all the children in the group displayed on this one page. You can also choose to select them all in one go. So I go to select items and click on all. And you can see at the bottom here, it says I've selected with six children, print name labels and go. Now today I only want to print three children. So I'm gonna take off the three children that I do not wish to print labels for. And you can see now, it has gone down to with three children print name labels. As I'm ready, I'm happy with the three children I've got. I'm going to click on go. And this takes me to a new page. This is the labels style page. Now from this page, you can choose one of the styles that you want to print on. The first four are 80 mil by 50 mil labels. And you tend to get two columns of five, which gives you 10 labels per sheet. Style 1 will give you their full name with a picture. Style 2 will give you their first name with no picture. Style 3 will give you full name with no picture. And Style 4 will give you their surname with picture. If you were looking to do draw labels instead of sticky labels, Styles 5, 6 and 7 will allow you to do that and these are 177 mil by 40 mil. Style 5 is their full name with a picture. Style 6 is their full name with no picture, and Style 7 is their full name, but just the initial of their surname, and no picture. Once you've chosen the style that you wish to print, all you have to do is click on it. So if I choose Style 4, you'll see it opens up a new page. Now the children that had profile pictures have got their pictures shown on this one because that was on the style I chose. O Edwards though doesn't have a profile picture, so it just leaves an empty box. This empty box could be used to have a sticker or get the child to draw a picture in there for you, whatever you choose really. Now if you decide that you didn't want this style, all you have to do is go back to the style tab. Once back on the style tab, you can just choose a different one. So if I choose style seven, this is my draw labels with no pictures with their first name and just the in first initial of their surname. Once you're happy with your labels, you can go to print and you can choose to either print them in color or black and white. And you may also decide to print them straight onto sticky labels if you have the labels that are the right size. But please do remember to put them into the printer the right way around.